Composition of semen. Semen equal to spermatozoa plus seminal plasma. So we'll discuss. Uh, so we'll discuss about seminal plasma here. Seminal plasma. It has a long definition. Uh, I have made into. I have broken down it into some points. Like it is an extracellular fluid. It is an extracellular fluid. It is a medium vehicle for spermatozoa. And it contains mixture of secretions from male reproductive accessory sex glands. Contains mixture of secretions from male reproductive accessory sex glands. What is the function of seminal plasma? It serves as buffer. It serves as buffer and is like it's a very good nutrient medium. It is the nutrient medium for the spermatozoa and maintains the osmotic pressure. Maintains the osmotic pressure and a nutrient medium. Now coming to the composition. Composition. First, uh, inorganic ions. There are two major, uh, like two main, two types of inorganic ions. The major ions and the minor ions. The major ions are sodium, chlorine, potassium. The minor ions are minor ions are calcium, magnesium. See the potassium and sodium ratio. Potassium and sodium ratio are high in sperm cell. So here I have made a picture depicting it, like just to make it easier to remember. It is the sperm cell, and inside the sperm cell, the ratio like potassium and sodium ka ratio is there, like it's high, but it is low in seminal plasma. It is low in seminal plasma. So what's the function of this uh, inorganic ions? The function is to maintain optimal osmotic pressure for sperm survival. It maintains the osmotic pressure. The next uh, composition is the buffering agents. The next composition is the buffering agents. Buffering agents. Principal organic ion as buffering agent is the bicarbonate ion. Bicarbonate ion. Bicarbonate ion it is secreted by vesicular gland vesicular gland what is the function obviously if it's a buffer then it will maintain the ph guards acidic change in ph of semen but not sufficient but it is not sufficient though the next is energy substrate energy substrate contains uh, fructose sorbitol and gpc remember this uh, gpc okay like because the name is very difficult from gpc we can get like glyceryl phosphocholine glyceryl phosphocholine what's the source the source for fructose and sorbitol is the vesicular gland and this ves vesicular gland also secretes uh, the bicarbonate the bicarbonate that is the buffering agent the buffer agent vesicular gland here also the vesicular gland secretes fructose and sorbitol fructose and sorbitol then gpc is produced by epididymis gpc is produced by epididymis metabolism fructose is metabolized under both aerobic and anaerobic conditions fructose is metabolized by both aerobic and anaerobic conditions whereas sorbitol and gpc used only aerobically used only aerobically one more point you need to remember here is that GPC cannot be used metabolized as such. So GPC is like utilized after being converted into choline and glyceryl phosphate. Glyceryl phosphate. Glyceryl phosphate by an enzyme present in the f in the female genital tract. So sometimes we get confused about like with the name GPC. Earlier it was GPC, right? GPC. It gets break, it's it gets broken down into choline separately, choline, and then after choline, it the other part is glyceryl phosphate. See GP, GP glyceryl phosphate, GP glyceryl phosphate. Okay, the other compound is other in other organic compounds like inositol and citric acid, and ergothionin, ergothionin. Found in boar and sorry, this is not saline. It is staline. 
stallion stallion it is stallion stallion